let's now look at a circuit which I am drawing right now ok let's just say I have my diode which looks like this ok to this diode I input my AC power supply ok so let's just say my AC power supply is like this ok I am connecting it to the ground over here now this diode is connected to my load resistor ok so let's just say my load resistor is like this ok I connect this to the ground as well this is my RL load resistor this is my diode D and this is my input power supply I am assuming it is a sinusoidal power supply which looks like this ok let's just say this is my V out ok I want to see what is the voltage available over here ok and this is my V in ok so I have applied a input sinusoidal AC voltage as my input voltage over here ok and I am going to try to see what is happening to my output voltage just see you are having a positive half cycle and you are having a negative half cycle ok during a positive half cycle you are having a higher potential to your P type over here so basically during positive half your diode is acting in forward bias conditions ok in the negative half cycle you have a negative potential or a lower potential connected to your P type ok therefore during negative half your diode is acting in reverse bias conditions ok we know my forward bias basically acts like a closed switch ok and my reverse bias basically acts like a open switch ok so let me just copy this circuit over here and I'll paste it down below let's see what happens in positive half we have seen in positive half my diode looks like a closed switch ok so I'm just simply going to take this diode and I am going to have a closed switch over here which is this way ok so I am talking about my positive half ok during positive half my AC signal is like this ok so since I have a closed switch this entire potential is going to be available across my load resistor therefore my V out is also going to be like this ok now let's look at my negative half ok in my negative half my diode is looking like an open circuit or a open switch ok so my diode is something like this since you have a open switch over here no current is flowing in this circuit ok so we are talking about negative half ok so your signal is like this and there is no current flowing in this circuit and you have a ground over here so essentially all this is 0 volts ok so what you are going to get as output is a flat line you are going to have no voltage or 0 voltage available across your load resistor when you are having a negative half cycle ok so in positive half cycle your output is same as your input and in negative half cycle your output is zero ok so just see let me just draw you the input and output waveforms ok let's, let's draw it over here ok so my input waveform basically looks like this I have a simple sinusoidal voltage ok my output waveform looks like this during positive half cycle I have my sinusoidal voltage during negative half cycle I do not have any voltage ok obviously this is a repeating waveform 